Hey everyone, welcome back to HTech, your trusted channel for everything related to Windows, new technology, and insider updates. In today's video, we re going to explore the brand new Windows 11 to 5 H2. Preview build 26220.6772 that has just been released in the dev channel. This update brings a collection of visual improvements, new features, AI integrations, dark mode enhancements, setup experience changes, and a variety of stability fixes. If you are new here and love to stay updated on Windows Insider builds, tips, and performance updates, make sure to subscribe to HTech and press the notification bell so that you never miss a future upload. Let us get started and dive into what S new in this exciting Windows 11 to 5H to build. About the dev channel build this new preview build, 26220.6772, is part of the Windows 11 to 5H2 branch currently being tested in the dev channel. The dev channel is where Microsoft experiments with upcoming ideas and system improvements before rolling them out to public versions. Some of these features may later appear in the stable release, while others might remain exclusive to testers. In short, this build gives us a glimpse into what Microsoft is preparing for the next major Windows 11 update. AI and Copilot plus PC enhancements Microsoft continues its focus on AI integration by introducing advanced Copilot plus PC features in this build. These are designed to make the user experience more intelligent, visual, and efficient. The first AI enhancement is Image Object Select and Click To Do. This tool allows users to identify, highlight, and isolate individual objects within an image. It's especially useful for designers, editors, and creators who need precision when working with visuals. Another powerful AI improvement is unit conversion via Click To Do. This feature automatically detects numbers paired with units on your screen such as currency, temperature, or distance and provides instant conversion results. It's a simple but clever addition that saves time and increases productivity. Together, these AI upgrades bring Windows closer to becoming a smart assistant that adapts to your daily workflow. Enhanced Windows Hello Signing Security Security has always been a top priority for Microsoft. In this build, Windows Hello receives a meaningful update. Previously, biometric sign-in options like fingerprint recognition were limited to devices that had built-in sensors. With this new version, Microsoft now supports peripheral fingerprint scanners, allowing desktop users and those without built-in biometric hardware to take advantage of the same secure sign-in system. You can find this setting by going to Settings gives Accounts, gives Sign-in Options, gives additional settings. This change ensures that a wider range of devices can enjoy enhanced protection without compromising convenience. A new Windows Setup Experience, one of the biggest functional changes in this build, is the new Windows 11 Setup Process. Microsoft has slightly redesigned the out-of-box experience oop to give users more control and structure when installing Windows. You can now name your default user folder during the setup process, which provides more personalization and easier file management later on. However, Microsoft has also removed the option to create a local account directly during setup. Now, you must use a Microsoft account and have an internet connection to proceed with installation. According to Microsoft, this decision was made to ensure proper device configuration and full functionality during setup. But many advanced users see it as a restrictive move that takes away flexibility. Fortunately, tools such as Rufus still provide workarounds that allow for local account creation if you build a custom installation media. Overall, this new setup process represents Microsoft's push toward cloud-connected, account-based systems, even though it may not please everyone in the Windows community. Improved Dark Mode Dialogues and File Explorer Dark Mode in Windows 11 continues to evolve, and this build introduces one of the most visually appealing updates so far. Microsoft has refreshed the File Explorer with new Dark Mode compatible system dialogues, covering key actions like copying, moving, and deleting files. These dialogues now feature modern design consistency, smooth progress bars, and improved readability across both the default and expanded states. Even the confirmation and error messages have been updated to match the dark aesthetic. This update may seem subtle, but it contributes to a smoother, it's more unified interface that reduces eye strain and feels more premium. Many users are still hoping that Microsoft will extend dark mode to the remaining legacy components, such as the Run dialog box and older system menus. 
which would finally make the Windows 11 dark theme completely consistent. General fixes and improvements beyond the visual and AI upgrades. This build also delivers a variety of fixes and system stability improvements. Microsoft has resolved an underlying issue that caused certain features to disappear after previous flights, ensuring more consistent performance across insider devices. In the taskbar and system tray, Microsoft fixed a bug where the system tray remained visible when the auto-hide option was enabled. Another issue that caused the taskbar to stay on screen even when all windows were minimized has also been corrected. Additionally, they fixed a focus-related issue that caused app thumbnails to dismiss without actually bringing the selected window to the foreground. In File Explorer, a problem with encrypted file system dialogues not responding to text scaling changes has been fixed. This ensures better accessibility for users who rely on larger text sizes. For Windows Studio effects, an issue that caused the camera preview to fail when the feature was activated on some external webcams has been resolved. In Settings and Network, Microsoft corrected inaccurate link speed readings on certain network adapters. They also fixed playback issues with Blu-ray, DVD, and digital TV apps that use high-definition content protection systems. Lastly, in Hyper-V Virtualization, startup issue affecting virtual machines with trusted platform module TPM on ARM64 devices has been fixed, improving virtual environment stability. Known issues in this build. Every preview build comes with its share of known issues, and this one is no exception. Microsoft has reported a problem with the touch keyboard that may fail to launch on the lock or login screen. If you encounter this issue, you can still access the on-screen keyboard through the accessibility menu as a workaround until a code around, until a permanent fix is released in upcoming builds. Future updates and what's next, according to trusted insider sources like Phantom of Earth, the upcoming builds in the dev channel will continue expanding AI capabilities, capabilities enhancing Windows Copilot and modernizing older interface elements. These ongoing developments show that Microsoft is preparing Windows 11 to 5H2 be a major step forward in visual design, performance, and smart computing integration. As always, these updates are experimental, and features may evolve or change before the public release. That is, staying informed through channels like HTech is essential if you want to follow Microsoft's development direction in real time. And that wraps up our full review of Windows 11. 25H to build 26,220.6772. This update delivers meaningful changes in both functionality and appearance. With AI enhancements, security upgrades, setup adjustments, and deeper dark mode integration. If you found this breakdown helpful, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to HTech, turn on notifications so you never miss any of our future tech updates and tutorials. I'm from HTech, and I'll see you in the next video. Till then, stay informed, stay secure, and keep exploring the best of modern technology.